Firecracker Development and Reference Design Board can be purchased through Silica on www.silica.com. My name is Lau Lane. I'm a senior application engineer for Evnet Silica based in Holland. I'd like to uh, show you some of the uh, merits of this uh, evaluation and demonstration kit which Evnet Silica have developed together with uh, analog devices and Blue Technics. We'll now look at the contents of this uh, evaluation board, the Firecracker, based on the Blackfin 537. It's a very sturdy little box, packed chock-a-block with all kinds of goodies. Right at the top, we see this Mr. Packed evaluation board, very nice red color. core module based in the center, a display, quarter VGA display, an Omnivision CMOS sensor and a multitude of connectors to interface all kinds of uh, serial connectors and audio and video to the evaluation board. We'll get back to that later on. What else is in the box? A universal power supply with the sockets for all over the world. I'm using the Dutch socket. A line card detailing all of the different lines that Silica, Evnet Silica, sell. A very handy booklet called Getting Started with Blackfin Processors. This details a lot of the different tools that are available for Blackfin and how you can get started, both hardware and software wise. And of course, a CD containing all of the relevant material, both software and hardware. Ah, headphones, so that you can hear what the evaluation board outputs. As I told you earlier, the main part of the board is the core module placed here. You can quite easily remove it, revealing the two interconnect connectors. Replacing the board or replacing the module is a relatively simple process if you align the two sockets. To interface with the outside world, there are a number of uh, connectors. Audio, video in, video out, a wireless module connector, a connector for a CMOS sensor, an Omnivision CMOS sensor, a JTAG connector, a USB debug agent connector, because the board can be obtained with and without a debug agent. This makes it possible to use a low-cost integrated debug module. Power connector, of course, for the external power supply. Ethernet connector, because the Blackfin 537 has an Ethernet Mac on board. USB on-the-go connector, because, of course, you can also use a Blackfin 527 core module on this, bo on this same board. And that supports USB on the go. Continuing on, here we have a Silynx JTAG connector because on the bottom of the board there is a Silynx Spartan FPGA together with an expansion header. A USB, a serial to USB connector, a CAN connector and a serial connector. The display, quarter VGA color TFT display with a LED backlighting, a number of input keys, a joystick and an SD card connector. The Firecracker board comes with a number of pre-programmed example programs. I'll now, now demonstrate the first example program which you can call up by configuring these jumper switches. 
By default, the first program shows an image which comes in through this CMOS sensor and is output on this quarter VGA display. After powering up, you see the boot screen which runs on black, the Black Sheep framework based on the VDK operating system, the Visual DSP operating system, which comes free of charge with Visual DSP development environment. You now see the person videoing this demonstration. This application shows an image from this uh, CMOS sensor which connects gluelessly to the Blackfin 537 PPI port, parallel peripheral interface port, and then outputs that data over the external memory bus to the Silinx FPGA, which is connected on the back. The Silinx FPGA runs an LCD application which drives this LCD. This is just one of the example programs already pre-programmed into the flash, external flash of the uh, Blackfin processor on this board. Target markets that can be focused on using this board are home security, portable media, industrial control. And virtually any application that you can think of can be utilized with a Blackfin processor. These boards can be purchased from Avnet Silica and the core modules as well. Thank you for watching this demonstration.